Hello guys, good evening and welcome back to Ivikali vlog. I hope you guys can see me in full. Um, actually, you have the camera on the window and I'm a bit too far because I want to show you what's happening behind me. And um, today's video we're going to do organization of my closet and I want to show you guys the process. Uh, what I do is just to fold the clothes and then put the ones in the hanger, the ones that I put on the hanger, though not so many. So I have the baskets around here that will help me in organizing the clothes. So without any further ado, I think we'll just go straight into folding the clothes. My baby, just chill. We'll go straight into folding the clothes. Yeah, so I'll show you the whole process. I have this that I'm going to use to put the clothes that I'm yet to fold. And then also this one, and my baby just gone inside, it's a plastic. <laughs> Sorry, Baba, he's so playful, but he's okay. Okay, so, and this one also, that I'm going to put bags inside and probably anything else that I'll need to put in there. And then I have the table that is going to help me to fold. And as I fold, I'll be sitting on this stool. Yeah, see. My stool looks, is it weather beaten or what? It's old, it served me for a while, but... Is the one that I'm going to use and then the clothes are over here so I'm just going to transfer the clothes inside the baskets either of them the two and then the hangers I think some of them will stay and the ones that are not looking like that are not looking nice like these ones I'll just have to reorganize and then put back yeah and then I don't think there's much to do up there because uh, some of the things that I was putting out, out up there are not uh, there actually so yeah I'll just do organization of this part Probably and maybe the area where by I sh where I keep the shoes. So let's go. So I'm just going to take every. I'm going to take the clothes out of the closet. That and I started with the first. Uh, the ones that are really at the front part. So I'll just put them there. And then of course after this process is done, I'll have to set up the camera somewhere. Uh, where you can see the table area. So I'm just transferring everything. So guys, I've taken everything out uh, except this jacket because there's not much to do from this. I'm just going to also add other clothes on the same hanger, guys, because the hangers I have are not enough. And maybe get this blazer off. Uh, if you saw the yellow blazer, I'm going to put them together so that all blazers are lined in one particular hanger. And let's go. So I'll start with the first. I'll start with the shirts. Yeah, start with the shirts. So guys, I'm putting the shirts back on uh, the hanger. I'll try to do this as fast as possible so that we don't spend so much time on it. So I usually put all my shirts in one particular hanger. But I search uh, all the time with maybe the white ones. Yeah. So I do this for shirts and then I also do this for the blazers. And once I'm done, the other things that cannot stay on the hanger, I put them down here. So I'm just putting more shirts in. So that when I'm, I'm leaving the house, I usually know the shirts are in a particular place. Yep. And sometimes I put them inside out. But because uh, this is on the hanger, uh, there's one will be on top of the other. So there's no need because none of them will get dirty. Yeah. Let's just go ahead and add more. And guys, I also like to color code the hanger. So if the white ones, I put them like uh, the whites in one line. Then once I'm done with that, I put the black, I have red and green. Yes, so that's how I do it. So I just go ahead and have the black. I'll have the black hanger for the for the blazer, so I'll start with the yellow one. Um, I'll put the green 
and probably the red. I put, I'm putting the blazers here, so I'll just put the red one on top. So I cut all the blazers, uh, stay in one, one hanger. So I started, with, I started with the yellow, the green, and then the red. So I'll just go ahead and put them there. Uh, the shirts part of them are here, and this, then these ones. But I don't have much uh, clothes, guys, so I don't think uh, I'll be putting really much. I'm starting the folding process, so I'm just going to place this camera somewhere that uh, can focus on the table. Yeah. I hope you guys will be able to see perfectly. So guys, this is what I've folded so far. I am putting the material, the trousers with the fabrics. I don't know, we call them material in Kenya. I don't know what they are called what. Uh, the ones that are not denim, jeans, like these ones. So I'll put all the jeans, uh, the black and the blue all together, uh, right here in one line. Then I'll put the, the material ones in that line. Then of course I'll have the dresses here and uh, the skirts there and uh, maybe towel. I just added towel. Yeah, over there. So let me continue as I show you guys. emptied all the uh, baskets so just put everything back I just don't know why it doesn't look that presentable but I have put everything all in order and yeah that's it so I'm ready for my Monday so when I come in I'll just know that uh, I have this particular cloth over here so Everything is all arranged and uh, neatly looking. And this hanger only has two blouses. I just put the white one first, then I put the blue one. Because this the blue, I'll be wearing it tomorrow, Monday. Uh, most Mondays I try to wear an official uh, clothing. So I have it. I want it near. Well, I'll just uh, grab it in the morning and uh, go. So, yeah. And also the jacket is here. Guys, it's starting to get dark, so I hope you can still see. And this is a strap for my one of my kimonos. I don't know where it went. I think it's somewhere in the house, but I'll have to look for it. 
So yeah, that's it. I'm all done. Uh -huh. I am all done. I don't know. It doesn't look different, right? Guys, if you notice any difference, just tell me. I just feel like I arranged everything. I have finished, but then I feel again like it doesn't look any different. So, yeah, but that's it for me. I am done and I'm not doing this again. So, till uh, next weekend again. So, yeah, that's the end of it, guys. And if you're yet to subscribe kindly, uh, just hit the subscribe button. Please support this girl. And also turn on your post notification button. So that you get notified every time I'm posting or when I'm having a premiere. So I just emptied everything. The plastics are all uh, free and I have some uh, few dirty clothes over there. And then I'm going to arrange that corner because there are a lot of uh, bags that are just on top of each other. Plus some duvet that should not be here. So I'll just take this off and put it uh, there because I have space somewhere uh, here on top. Yeah, I have space somewhere here that I'm going to put that. So I'll just put the next blanket on top of that and then the next one. This place actually fits four of the duvets, three of the duvets, because this is actually not a duvet, it's a small blanket. So yeah, but I'm done with the organizing, I'm so happy. Yeah. So I'm going to start my Monday on a positive note. But I didn't organize my boy's closet. I'll show you guys next time. It's looking a bit disarranged. So I'll have my house manager doing it. Because uh, as you can see, uh, the duck has catch up with me. And I know in a few minutes my camera won't be that clear. So that's it for now. And I'll also go ahead and arrange the shoe area. So I'll just put the shoes in uh, one by one. On the top part here. There are some of the things that shouldn't be here. Yeah, but some of them are supposed to be there. So no problem, guys. Yeah, I think God will bless you. So thank you so much and uh, you have a wonderful evening.